Hey everybody, Pookie TVX. They got another one of us, y'all. Evan Lindell Parker died in a jail cell, same exact jail cell as uh, Miss Bland. Hung the same way she was hung. Do y'all think this was coincidence? Do you think, you know, things like this happen? You know, do you think, hey, you know, maybe he went in there down on his luck? Well, if you're thinking like that, then you don't need to be on this fucking channel. You need to fucking get the fuck off, click out, and get the fuck out right fucking now. There's gonna be some motherfucking facts going on here today. And if you ain't fucking ready for them facts, you gotta fucking kick rocks. Kick boulders. We know what it is. We see the shit. We ain't fucking stupid. We've been seeing it for over 400 years. It's a goddamn execution. Second one they had. I wonder if they get another one. They get some type of a, a coon killing award, some kind of nigga killing award that goes undetected. People protest for a few days and forget about it. They wait for that. They wait for us to speak up a few and then next you know it dies down because we don't have the fucking, the patience and the fucking drive to fucking do what's needed to be done. Just like this Gucci shit, man. Motherfucker talking about uh, protesting for three months. What, three three months? Nigga, you mean three consecutive life sentences? Fucking three months. What the fuck is three months gonna do, nigga? That ain't gonna even touch their overhead. Talking about some damn three months, nigga. You, you sound like you, you, like you want to go back in three months. You niggas gotta stand for something, man. If you ain't gonna stand for nothing, you gonna fall for every fucking thing. And that's what we doing as a people. We fucking falling, man. We letting them know how weak we is, man. Yeah, we tough physically, and but when your mental ain't there, man, you fucking fucked, man. No matter how tough you is, you gonna fall into a fucking trap. Two of our people been killed in the same jail, same prison, same pod, same way. I shouldn't even have to name all the other people that's been killed by police brutality. I shouldn't, that's a long list that we all know very well. That's been going back since Jesus. That's irrelevant. We need to worry about the now. Sandra Bland, the outspoken activist for black rights and making programs to uplift and uh, help black people in a positive light get pulled over on a bogus, bogus, bogus um, stop. She uh, spit out her laws and what she known and her laws was correct. And they turned around and junked her around and put her in the car anyway and took her to jail. As she in jail for her $500 bond, she walks around and walks around Knowing that she could be out in a matter of days, not even not even days. If she went to court, they probably would have PR'd it. But she didn't get to make it to court, y'all. She was hung. If you'll see these ladies, this lady's videos and her bio on, 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 on how she was living and the things she was doing and how happy this woman was, there's no way this woman hung herself. No way. This is what they do to us, y'all. They tell us that it's, oh, it's depression. We've been having depression since the age we was born. We can deal with depression. 
White people's the ones who can't deal with depression and run to the nearest bridge and jump. Not us. Our whole life has been fucking depression and stress. So don't, so don't play that shit. We want the true facts. We want the real shit, man. And we know the real shit. We just can't prove it. Y'all hung that girl. And y'all hung that boy. With the boy, y'all probably figure, well, he already killed somebody. They say he killed somebody. So it's just save the taxpayers and everybody some time. And it's just open and shut case it right now. That's what y'all was thinking. Sad, man. It's sad. You know, I just have to speak on this real quick, man. Um, I'm going to do some more research on it because uh, it's starting to all connect now. Even the one boy video I did where he was hanging in the tree with his pants hanging down to his ankles with a um, rope that looked like it was professionally uh, made. And he was hanging there in his mama yard for his mom to come home and see him. And I guess that was a suicide too, huh? And then around yonder, it was another brother hung, same way. We don't stand up, y'all. We don't. We look at it and we say, oh, that's fucked up. We say, oh, that's messed up. We can't be like that, but we don't do shit. We don't do shit. But let a motherfucker scratch our car and try and drive off. Watch what the fuck you do then. You will go, you will go crazy ape shit. But this is another brother, another sister that's life has been taken. And we don't move an inch. We just say some angry shit and be upset, and then we'll go about our goddamn day. This shit's gotta stop today. It's gotta stop today, people. I'm calling for all my people, man. Post and share this, man. Share it, make you a video, post and share. Let's get this shit out here, man. This injustice has gotta stop. And we got to stop falling for it, man. Everybody sticking their fingers in our face, man, and telling us it's fucking sunshine. Gucci had to get that shit cleared on so many levels before it can hit the fucking stands. You mean to tell me every person cleared it and let it go out to the market knowing what it is? Or was it, a, oh, the niggas won't care to be a slap in the face and they'll be back buying way more Gucci? Because they're niggers. It's time, y'all. Support our own black businesses, our own black clothing lines, our own black whatever it is, man. If your brother making fucking shirts and pants, man, buy them shits. Support that brother. Your sister making shit, man, support that sister. It's time to take our money back and spend it with us. We gonna need it. All this fighting against each other and, and and all this bullshit that ain't doing nothing but just fucking deflecting off to what's really going on. We are dying out here, people. We are dying. Your kids are dying. Your brothers are dying. Your sisters are dying. Your aunties and your uncles and your fathers and your mothers. And your grandmamas that send them white nurse homes is dying. And they're getting away with it. You stand up, y'all. Please, you stand up and get it back, man. You stand up and get it back, man. Please. Please. This is to all my people, man. Power to my people, man. Just make this happen, man. Share this. Make you a video. And just tell how you feel and what you need to be done, man. And let's do it. We all we got, man. We all we got. We got to come together, man. I'm calling people out, man. Humble. You put me on with this. Dice, we need you, man. Max V World, we need you, baby. We need your intelligence. Who else is out there? Who else is out there? T-Bone from Colors, man. Put it on out there. Sayonetta, we need you. Real people. We need the real ones to come on and stand out, man. The real ones, man. 
Chips, oh boy, man. Everybody, man. Everybody, man. That fuck with me, man. Just come on, y'all. Let's do this. Let's do this, man. There's too many lives, man, being taken, and they, and they, and they are lives. They us. People like us, man, that are dying out here every single day. We can't have it, man. We can't have it. Yo, man, one love. I love y'all, man. Stay black. And let's get these streets back. I'm out.